So today we are going to see Abigaili take on Colwyn Bay in the National League North. We're going to get the train there first and I'm going to count the cost of the whole trip. So let's get going. So the train costs £2.45, it's a local match for me. So let's go. On top of that I got myself a drink, a Fanta, lovely lovely. £1.40, ridiculous pricing. That is the total so far. And this is where we're going to be playing the match. This is, this is the ground, here it is, it is Pentra Park, I was there half an hour before kick-off, but we're ready for kick-off here, not many people there yet, but here we are, kick-off, off we go, Abigail in the black and the green, and then Colwyn Bay in the white and the blue, do you subscribe if you enjoy, comment down below your thoughts on the match, and subscribe as well, let's have a look how we go here. Colwyn Bay kicking us off here. Abigail losing the ball right at the start in a really dangerous position. And the scrum half will feed this one out into the fly half. Who, by the way, keep an eye on him. He was fantastic for Colwyn Bay. Colwyn Bay here kicking the ball down. Should be a simple collection for the Abigail play. He drops it and their fullback is tackled out. It's a thrown here to Colwyn Bay. And this was the first 20 minutes or so, Abigail hardly touched the ball at all. Great take there from the lock, bringing it down and creating a maul for Colwyn Bay. And Colwyn Bay were fantastic all afternoon. The scrum here now, no points on the board, about 20 minutes or so gone, but it's all been Colwyn Bay. And there you go, Abigail standing up in the, in the scrum. A line out taken from the free kick. They get the ball here, and this is going to be try number one. You shall see in a second. Some great play from the forwards here, down the um, down the right, getting tackled, created into some sort of a maul, but then collapsed. And then the ball is out here, out into the centre, who runs through, and scores a try. It is 5-0 to Colwyn Bay, a deserved lead. Can they get the conversion? The fullback, who also had a fantastic match, he steps up. Can he convert? Yes, he can. Colwyn Bay is 7-0 up. Colwyn Bay once again coming forward here. Great scrum. Their set piece was fantastic. They're running through here, but tackle just short of the line. But a penalty given for coming around the side of the ruck, and it is kicked over again from the fullback, who was exquisite. Abigail did try and play in this first half, but here's the second half, and once again Colwyn Bay attacking down the left hand side here. Again, the fullback being present. This linesman's got a very strange run, you'll notice in a minute as he's running. But again, Abigail is trying to play a little bit, but just cannot keep hold of the ball. Silly mistakes and giving the ball away in really dangerous positions. It was a comfortable afternoon for Colwyn Bay, in all honesty. Ball out here on the far side, and Colin Bay defending for the latter stages. Here we go, scrum in the 22 of Colin Bay. These were the close-up shots, so not that much happened really um, for the rest of the second half. But then the game lit up with this fantastic run. Very unfortunate not to get the try there. Good interception from Abigail. This is just a pan of the pitch. A good turnout there, probably about 100 people today to see non-league rugby. And just get down to see your local team. If you're new, get down to see your local team. What a try this was by the prop, by the way, who charged down that kick and got in the corner. Can they convert it, though? Let's have a look. And unfortunately, it flies just wide of the post there. By this point, Colin Bay had run in four or five tries. The score at this point was 45-9 to Colwyn Bay. They were dominating this match. Abigail are second bottom of the league, and it showed, and Colwyn Bay are third in the league currently. So they're going to take it quick here. Abigail try and get some points forward, and a big hit there. What a hit that is. Very physical. People talking about the game going soft. I can't say that's true. Look at these hits, though. So there you go, the final score. 55-9 to nine to Colwyn Bay, a thumping of a score for Colwyn Bay.